What's up guys? Welcome back to an episode of Pokemon HeartGold, and hello! My name is Gamer Meg, and I'm actually doing this commentary for Nick because he asked me to do a commentary for him, which is a great honor because he is a fabulous commentator. I love his work, and I'm happy to do it. So, quick introduction to myself, I am also a commentator, and uh, the reason that I would like to do Pokemon Heart Gold is actually because I have a little bit of a sentimental connection to it. Pokemon Gold, original, was my first Pokemon game uh, for Game Boy Advance, <laughs> and I bought it with my own money when I was probably 11 years old, and I absolutely loved it. It was just so much fun, and oh no. You don't mess with Typhlosion. Anyway, I actually had the same starter Pokemon, actually. I, I chose Cyndaquil as my starter Pokemon, and I can't believe that he has a shiny Gyarados. I'm so jealous that he has a shiny Gyarados. I never did catch that one. But anyway, Pokemon Gold was my first Pokemon game that I actually bought for myself, and I loved it. I have such a sentimental connection to this game. and. When I got a 3DS for and got like the whole the new Pokemon and stuff, I actually got Soul Silver. But oh no, it's the quiz. Friend, I wanted to ask you guys real quick. When you take this quiz, I want to know. Did you answer with the of course the love and their friends, and you have to teach them with love and compassion and you know like all of like those super nice answers or did you go through and be a sarcastic person did you go through and you're like you have to treat them with violence and you can only battle trainers who are awesome because i want to know if any of you ever did that and i want to know what it said because i never did <laughs> i never i always went through and i was like pokemon are friends and so i want to know if you went through and put them in the bad answers and so if you did Tell me in the comment section below. Back to what I was saying before, besides the fact that I hate Claire. Claire is awful and I hate her. I got Soul Silver, and I I love it on the one hand, on the other hand I kind of regretted it because I loved Heart Gold and I love Ho-Oh, but you know, they're both amazing games. And in this game, it kind of like, <laughs> when you're riding on a Pokemon that's a water Pokemon, I don't know why it looks like you're riding on an underwater blimp. Like for real. It looks like, you know, in Avatar The Last Airbender, those Fire Nation blimps? That's what it looks like. It looks like a purple Fire Nation blimp that you ride on. Whatever. That's right, Claire. Apologize. Nobody likes you and your stupid Dragonites that- Is it Dragonairs or Dragonites? She has like two of them, and she never evolves them. She just has two of them that she like lets sit. What's the point of even having two of them if you're not gonna evolve them? Like, that's my whole beef. Because it took me forever to freaking beat her, and she's not even that great. She just has oh, the most ridiculous Pokemon. Oh, who's, who's calling us? Professor Elm? I don't want to go to your house. I'm questing right now. Leave me alone. I have to jump on my blimp real quick. Give me a minute. Mine. I feel like Gyarados is bigger than this entire lake. Like, you can't just, like, swim across the lake, you have to get your Gyarados out and have him, like, take up the whole pond. But whatever. But both of them are amazing games. Soul Silver, Heart Gold. I would definitely recommend them to all of you. And... Yeah. Uh, I'm definitely a Fire Pokemon person, and so I always chose, you know, Charmander and Cyndaquil, and I never ever chose Bulbasaur or Grass Pokemon. Sometimes I would choose, like, whoa, why is it glitching out? Is it, it almost looked like old school Pokemon for a minute. That was weird. But anyway, it's coming to a close, guys. Thanks so much for listening to me, and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, until then, you guys, stay sweet.